All right, who wants to tell us real quick what just happened? All right. A little distracted by the technology. Couldn't tell whether the barking was from the, the phone or real. You know? Yeah, because I downloaded the video from Sever's GoPro uh, from the first bear. Yeah. And, uh, I'm having so much fun with that. that uh, Sever, don't snatch that club out the tree. Yeah. yeah we weren't supposed to say that. <laughs> Delete. Cut that out. <laughs> cut, cut. <laughs> but yeah, he engaged all right. I'm going to put some clips in the video. But um, yeah, while well, watching the video... So they were barking in the video, but someone says, oh, they're barking. I'm like, yeah, yeah, they're barking in the video. I'm like, no, 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 they're barking over there. And we'll look at the Garmin, and indeed, they treat something 300 yard, yards over there. So we're going to go and take a look. They're about 300 yards that way below us. It's crazy. You ready? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's crazy how little you can hear. It's like yeah, because of the terrain. Yeah. Yeah. Soaks it all Plus the wind and the river down below is also. In Indiana, you could probably hear a dog barking from half mile, five, six. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. You ready? <laughs> Yeah, it's right. Just right down the map. Come on, it's right down the map. Come on, it's right down the Yep, that's the way you can Too small. A baby the puppy's lost again puppy it's okay it's safe you can come up here Come on, Kuma, let's go, let's go.
Puppy. 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 Puppy's tired. Good morning. Today's day two of the West Virginia early season, the second section of that season or segment. Uh, yesterday we had two cubs, sows with cubs, cubs. Um, today we're gonna, it's starting to get daylight. We're gonna road hunt the dogs for about a mile and then hike. We'll see what happens there. This is good to you, but it's going to be different. Yeah, like, I don't, I don't get the, the perk of the money. Yeah. So, Sever, we're, it was just starting to get daylight. We went road hunting, so running, riding vehicles and letting the dogs run. They st struck a hot track ran down the river to the river sever bear crossed the river and the river now is freaking what did it look like cody how would you describe that river angry angry yeah Very so high. um sever crossed julik the young male he decided not to so sever is now trying to pick that bear's track because he got carried you can see the diagonal line where he got carried down by the current, so he's now looking for where the bear came ashore, and he's gonna try to pick up that track and continue chasing. In fact, he is, I think he's climbing now, so he probably picked it back up and he's chasing that bear. If he treats that bear, that'd be something. I mean, that'd be really I something. Think would, I'm surprised the bear can't actually cross the river. No, it well, like see, yesterday. yeah. Apparently that's what they do to get away. All right, now we'll wait till and see if Sever. I don't think any other dogs are going to be crazy enough to cross the river. Mine are just getting down towards. They're yep. down towards it now, but I doubt they'll cross. Well, we're tracking Sever. We're going to give him a couple of minutes, see if he can seal the deal. So, I'm just going to. Cody and I decided to, because all our dogs, except for Sever, were still on this side of the river. And we're like, we don't want, and they're not going to cross at this point because they're not as motivated as Sever was because Sever was chasing that bear. And so we're like, let's just tone because Sever was 1.2 miles and, you know, he was, he would have treated that bear. I'm pretty sure. I mean, I can't say for sure, but he's been good so far. I'm like, imagine if he crosses the river, the way, the state that the river is now at, it's, it's a puppy barking lost puppy anyhow we're like okay let's call the dogs back by the time the dogs come back the ones that didn't cross we're gonna drive around and go to sever and shoot that bear i mean that would i mean so we got our garments we can start toning the dogs pushing the tone button and i'm not even thinking i just 
start pushing the button and I, and I tone sever. And as soon as I do that, I like I realize I made a mistake and I look at the screen and sever stopped and starts backtracking like a good boy that he is. What's up? That's a puppy, he's lost. That's a lost puppy bark. Uh, that's it, that's the end of that story. I mean, it would have been awesome, but. Yeah, he's, as you like it, that's that puppy, he's lost. Sever, I'm gonna show you. He crossed the river here. He was following that bear and that's where I toned him. He is backtracking, because he's a good boy. But I, and I'm a dumbass. Why did I do that? That's just. Oh man. Maybe he'll find another bear. Duh. So we were standing here debating what we're gonna do because we have you know, hunters with us. We want to get on the bear. So we're thinking, should we? We're, so we're, we have two trucks. We came up with a plan where Cody drives all the way around. Did you just spit? <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> You're on YouTube. <laughs> so, yeah, we came up with a plan where Cody... I shared Sever's codes with him so that he drives around and picks up Sever. In the meantime, Sever had other plans. He just crossed the river again. And he got carried off downstream a little bit. And he's coming back up. I mean, this is insane. Wait till you see that. At some point, we're going to get... On the river. To some cliff, yeah, we'll show you the river. It's raging. It's insane. Look, there he is. How awesome to get across. He got across, now he's back and he's he's backtracking. Well, I mean, he's he's gonna be exhausted. He's gonna be exhausted, yeah. But yeah. wow, and the, and the the rest of the dogs are coming back, and that's but. We're gonna turn this into a positive experience and we're gonna, by showing you all this, we're gonna showcase how stress-free this Leica hunting is. I mean, you just push the button and it's coming back to you through, what's the saying, through hell and high water, <laughs> which is exactly what it is. Wait till you see that river. This is the aftermath of Helen, Hurricane Helen. That river is yeah, it's not looking good. I mean, that's you saw it's New River. It's a whitewater destination, one of the prime destinations in, in this part. It's angry, no matter what. But now, right now, it's ugly. And that guy, he's just something else. But that's not our goal. Is to get a bear. So we'll wait for him to get back up here. I was going to say, we'll give him a drink. I don't think he's going to need a drink. <laughs> uh, anyways, let's wait for Sever. What in the world? Look at him. I didn't turn on the GoPro. I didn't think it would... I mean, I didn't think they would jump a bear that fast, but... Sever, are you insane? Uh, out of your mind? <clears throat> How was that river? Look at him. That is crazy. All right, let's go find a bear. Hopefully the next one doesn't swim the river again. Again, like we could just cut track. Kuma went that way, Sever went that way. She realized she's backtracking. She's trying to find, see, she's following the track. Yeah. So Sever's already up ahead. Yeah, watch, watch her. Yep, she's. to the ground she's still going in the meantime Sever is already 300 yards away 
and Kuma. See, Kuma, she's gonna get on the same track. And the young dogs are, well, they're young dogs. But Sever's about to jump that bear, I'm sure. All right, they are treed. 700 yards as a bird flies, but in reality, they went down, almost down to the bottom of the canyon by the river. Again, barking. It's gonna be a long day, I can tell. Hopefully it's not a cub again. But if it is a cub, then it is what it is. So we're way above the river. The river down below is, I mean, you can see up here, but down there it's thick. It's real thick with this stuff. The dogs are doing something weird. I can't, I don't understand. They go, they bark a little bit, they move. Either they're a walk bane and they're exhausted. Or the bear bays up and then takes off. They lose him for a second. Because again, imagine down there it's much thicker. So the dog is run, running full tilt. And there's just trees appearing out of nowhere in this white, white stuff. So it's been ongoing now for almost half an hour. And it would run for 200 yards and then bark again. And then lose it. Kind of split. And then one of the dogs finds it. So... I guess the scent of conditions in this are virtually non-existent. I mean, it's almost impossible. But because they're they're right there with the bear, and it's trying to get away, but it's, they keep finding and keep staying with him. But I don't know for how much longer they can keep doing it because they must be exhausted by now. Yeah, it's just barking. Sever fell behind. Let's see if they can free it. Hopefully, it doesn't pull the other dogs off of that bear. No, I hope the other dogs step in and doing whatever they're doing. Yeah, Kuma's going to them. So, Kuma and Sever stayed way down below and they eventually lost the bear. And we tried to get on top of them. Here, I'll show you. Kuma started coming up, and that's when Chooch, the little female that Cody has, just tree the bear. There's someone tree it. Hopefully it's a bear. Oh, wait, oh listen to Kuma. Wow, Papa. That's Kuma. Kuma don't bark. I see who came up to that. She just got there, yeah. Uh, now she's up there. Right yeah, she just got there. Because she was not far. Sever's behind. That's a bear. I wonder if it's the same. Well, Kuma was coming up, yes. So they kept catching up with a bear, and he kept moving, moving, moving. That's Kuma. So yeah, that makes sense. See, see where Sever gave up here or lost sand track. Kuma was slowly making, every now and again she'd be barking, but slowly. Because she was coming out from there. And you can't see anything down there. So they pushed the bear, Kuma pushed the bear, and Chooch ran into it and treed. And he climbed up instantly. Well, I hope he climbed up. Hopefully, hopefully he's still in trees, which might make sense with fresh dogs and we'd be able to put a little more. But see, they're losing again. They're not, so he climbed up high and they're like not as excited as in the beginning. I mean, they're still excited because I mean, it's 140. Yeah, they're pretty close. Press it. Let's get in there and get it done. But see, the, the intensity changed because they, they can still smell it because up here it's not as I thick. Bet, I bet stuff's pushing up right now. Yeah, and the thermals are coming, exactly, yes. So right now everything's warming up and it's coming up. So the dogs, but they can probably see it because here at least they can see it. But down below, wow, what a, I mean, it's hard to explain. Like I've been following this whole thing unfold and I was like, it's just from going from highest of high and lowest to low, low, it's just, in my head, I'm like, oh, I don't know what's going on. We're going to lose it. And it turned out the way it turned out. Let's go take a picture of that cub and let him go. <laughs> huh? 
No, it doesn't. <laughs> So this is not a big bear by any means, but it's legal. Um, Nick is his first bear. And we hunted yesterday all day. I treed two cubs with small bears. This, this bear this bear is definitely bigger than the ones yesterday. So we're gonna he's gonna take him. Trying to come down. Now come down here. Do you see the bear at all? Yeah, she's not. She's not going to go anywhere. But we, so we can reposition. But if you think you're good, then yeah, I'll grab the pack. I got it. Just let us know when you're ready. You want to you want to move a little bit? Yeah, let's let's find a better spot. Hold on, hold on. Okay, hold on. Let's let's find a better spot. Come right here. Come follow me here. Hold on. Yeah. All right. Come, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Lean against this tree. All right. Take a shot now if you can. Uh, yeah, I'm loading the gun. You're good. Yep. That was a perfect shot too. In this terrain and a little intense, my hands might be slightly. All right, give me five. You did good, man. You're really good. Woo. Yeah, you can let him out. Let him off the leash. All right, so nothing in the chamber. Yep. Okay, good. <laughs> 